Yo, guys, Tony here. Well, I have another question that um, somebody has asked me to show them. Is how to add some overlays to your artwork or to your uh, games, like mine here. As you can see, I like to use a background, and then I found this on the internet and just put my information in here and all that good stuff. So I'm going to show you a few different ways that I use, well, a few different overlays you can use, and I'll give you the links where I got the overlays so you can do that. So I'm going to go ahead and show you basically using it for everything. I'm um, we'll going to go ahead and show you how to uh, do all this stuff. Uh, here, I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, Go ahead and uh, delete this. Yep. And go ahead and add a new scene. Call it new. So normally you would want something besides black. So let's go ahead and go into our sources. Let's go ahead and add a background image. Just put. I want to put BG for background. Browse. Um, let's see, what do we want to use for our background? What do we want to use? Let's just use this. It's just an example. Hit OK. Bam. Edit scene. It's just going to be purple, so it's not going to be no big deal. So, so there's my background. All right. Now, I want to add an overlay, so let's go ahead and add the overlay. Uh, um, you can, it's going to be image again, and I'm going to call it overlay. You can call it whatever you want, but it's just better to do it that way. I'll go ahead and browse my overlay. We're going to go ahead and use uh, this overlay here. So open. Now I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. You notice it's behind the uh, behind it, right? And it's white. Well, to fix that, you have to go into Properties again and select Chroma Key and hit OK. There, it made it, it made it invisible. So that's where that's going to be. And notice if I take this off, it's oh, wrong one. It's still going to be there with the black background. So that's the background image. That's the overlay. And you can add whatever you want, your chat or whatever, your YouTube information here, your webcam, and all that good stuff. Um, let's go ahead and add. Okay, that's pretty much it there. And you're probably wondering, how do you add the game? Wow, it looks really different. And like, it looks like orange there and fucking yellow here. It's funny. Um, let's go ahead and get our game up. Let's do... Um, Counter-Strike source. CSS. Oh, Steam's getting ready to go. And I'm sure you know how to set the game up to where it fit this. What, what you want to do is you want it just enough to where it fills this whole thing. Like to about right here. At least. Because you don't want to, um, what happened? Why can't I get the game up? There we go. So here's, oh, come on, here's our game that we're going to use. So now we got to go ahead and add our game. Add, uh, I'm going to do window capture, call it uh, CSS, good, good, select subregion. It's like subregion, you should know you all should know how to do this by now. Hopefully, now you, I'll link you to the other video to figure out how to do that as well. All right, that's done. That's done. That's done. That's done. Go ahead and post it in here. And then before you got to put everything order move down, and we're gonna go ahead and resize this. 
probably going to have to um, resize the game. So right now it's full screen. And if we do this, it's going to be small. So that's the goal. Um, let's see what it will look like. Yeah, because it's going to be bigger. So let's go see if we can find, uh, make it, um, make it, um, better for us to work with. Let's try, um, this one here. Uh, I still made it full screen. Now we gotta resize this. There. Bring it down. I mean, it should be okay if there's a little bit showing, but not much. But occasionally, that's what your overlay is going to look like when you're done. Um, so that That's what your overlay is going to look like. You're going to have your webcam, whatever. That's not going to be there. It's just going to be a demonstration. I'll show you kind of what it looks like. Let's just find a quick game here. Let's just go with bot game real quick, actually. Uh, create a server. And start. So you're gonna add your webcam there. Make sure your webcam's below the overlay so it's behind it. And there you go. There's your overlay. That should be uh, pretty much it on that. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. You can do this to any overlay any overlay you want so hopefully it'll work out for you you're not going to hear any sound because uh, so that's pretty much it on that if you have any questions uh, feel free to leave a comment down below and all that now before we go I'm going to go ahead and show you how to add uh, Twitch alerts to your stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and show you my one that I use all the time Pretty much. This is my setup. I don't mind to you use your this setup. Just make it a different color because blue is my favorite color So that's all done for that Hopefully I helped you out. So I'm gonna show you how to add chat and your uh, Twitch or alerts so it's in order to add chat is basically the same thing I already have it made on here. It's going to be on here. And you're going to need better Twitch TV. I'll put a link on how to get or I'll tell you how to get it. Or I'll link you a video that I found that helped me uh, do that. So I'll link that down below in the description box so you can figure that out for yourselves as well. Not that hard. Um, a few things I need to show you real quick before I qu quit this. Um, when you switch it to dark mode and then get better twitch tv you're gonna have um an option on darkened chat okay and your chat's gonna look small i'll, I'll just type it in and it's kind of off i'll just type something in and it's gonna be small and it's gonna be hard to read so if you do this darken it you can see it now all right I already have it aligned but what you have to really now what you have to do is you get the size you want you can have it up you can have it down you can have it however big you want 
Just make sure you have a new window capture option up and set the chroma color black so and then select like sub region it's already set that's done hit okay and there's your chat that's pretty much it on that twitch alerts is another window you're gonna have to make if you want it um i recommend firefox um if you can get to work on google chrome that'd be awesome but if you can't uh firefox is just as good that's what i use for Twitch alerts, and that's Twitch alerts. Come on, give me. There we go. Twitch alerts. Go ahead and launch Twitch alerts. Wow, we gained twelve followers last night. Nice. Um, alert, and then you go into alert box. If you have it set up, you should be good to go. You go ahead and hit launch. There's the alert box. Mine's already set up, but you can resize it or whatever. That is seen. See, mine's going to show up there, but this is a little big, I think. So I got to resize everything. So properties. Oh. I don't know why it does that all the time, so I'll go ahead and put that back on properties. It's like sub region. Yeah, it's a little bigger. So I'm going to go ahead and resize my window here. Actually, it's probably fine like that. And then bring that up just a tad. Right, let's go ahead and select sub region. There we go. Already lined up done so your twitch alerts is done um, it's gonna be over the game so your games here so it's gonna be on top of everything which is a good thing so I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate that hopefully this is this will help you out so let's go ahead and test I already had one open oh well go ahead and test them oh there it's up here Test follow, donation, host. And it'll pop up towards the left here. And so we're going to be pretty much it for the video. See? Well, you're not going to hear any sounds, but that's what it's going to look like. The way I have it set up, this monitor that I'm looking at doesn't have sound. It's just there for a monitor. That face gets funny. Funnier every time. In the hosting one, I've been having a problem. So that one's not working. Not sure if it's their end or my end or what, but we'll try it one more time. If not, that's pretty much it on overlay, adding overlays. If you have any questions, let me know. And I could show you on a live stream on how I do it, or I could show you in another video and do it step by step process. But this is the way I already had the stuff down. All the links will be down below where I get my stuff. As always, guys, thanks for watching, and this is Thunder. Peace out till next time, and have a great day. Hopefully this helped, and rock on. Rock on to the world content, baby, yeah.